All right, hi guys. So uh, I just checked the Will Prowse video. Uh, his had the temperature sensor that comes out of the side. Okay. Um, so differences between uh, ours. Uh, this goes all the way. Um, that this yeah this material here this goes all the way to the end on this one you guys it stops there's there's more of the green pcb under there uh same thing up here okay back here i don't know I, it might be the same thing uh yeah it's the same thing on the, or wait no okay i'm looking at the wrong side let me look at the pull up the picture okay yeah same thing so this area here yep uh mine goes all the way across um you guys are missing these mosfets okay also you have four here i have three more three here one here these two spots i believe it is uh are open on mine so I have twice as many diodes in mine as you guys do. Uh, what else? Um, oh, the uh, so we look on this side. We'll see there's these two little things here, um, which this one here also has two little things in there. But when I flip it over... Uh, on this side, there are three, okay, and when I look at uh, this photo here, whoops, sorry, wrong one, uh, I only see, whoops, I only see these two. There's not a third one, and it doesn't look like there's even a provision for a third one. Um, yeah, so I, I, I don't know, guys, I don't. I, I, yeah, I, I don't know. I'm going to redesign things to fit both versions. But, like I said, it, it, it I don't know. I don't know. And, yeah, uh, I did try to take it apart. I pulled the screws out. Um, I figured that's, you know, you guys deserve that. I, I couldn't separate these plates, the, the adhesive, the thermal compounds, fairly aggressive it wouldn't even start peeling and i wasn't going to start forcing stuff so i just put the screws back in and yeah so but that's uh that's it there guys you can see where the uh how far the copper runs of course you guys just don't run as far because you don't have any you know mine goes all the way up to here and catches that one and then it ends down here just like this so on this one but now on this one it comes up here all the way up and catches there so i i don't know um is there anything else that oops wrong thing here again uh and yeah mine are are full length just like pictured here um so that's yeah that that's uh, about it um you can see how that sticks out past let me uh how that sticks out past the um yep ever so slightly let me try it like that see so i'm going to go back to the me and ramon we're going to go back and we'll redesign it so it will fit either version um but obviously there are some differences Another thing, too, uh, you are missing this jumper down here on your board, and it's um, taking it, this is software, or I, I don't know, but yeah, and then it has the uh, UART port, U yort, yort, uh, whatever, and then of course here, and then it has some, uh, I don't know if that'll, let me see if I can shine light in there, probably won't focus. Um, I can't really read the lettering in there. Sorry, guys. 
and Logic Tech, Tech went to an all new software with this, and now I can't even I, I can't focus it manually that I've been able to find yet. So there we go. Um, yeah, those are the differences. Uh, yep, I don't know. Uh, might explain the price difference between the boards. I'm sure it probably does. It's quite honestly the most expensive thing on the boards is the damn MOSFETs. So, yeah. Uh, or switching transistors, what the hell ever they are. Anyhow, that's it, guys. All right. Talk to you later. Bye for now.